Okay, this is the Timberland, and it's in a nice neighborhood. I don't think it's the one. A little bit more of a traditional neighborhood. But the thing that concerns me on this one is the driveway. So. This is all the room that you have to maneuver in. Nice entryway. So you have one option for a sitting area. Really nice wood floors. Formal dining. Up here you have a secondary bedroom with a good size walk-in. And it has its own bathroom with bathtub. So guests would have their own area separate from the rest of the house. This is the family room. Wood burning fireplace. Breakfast area. So I'm not sure how you feel about the stove being in the island. I know you don't like the kitchen, the sink in the island, but it's the gas stove. Little butler's pantry goes back into the dining room. Extra storage. I'll show you the garage now because I'm right here. There are a couple of steps. But I think you're only going to be fitting your one vehicle in here. Now this is a fantastic size pantry. Laundry room. And a separate entrance for anyone staying in this 
little room. Again, another bathtub. Good size walk-in. In its own area, like a nanny, mother-in-law, long-term guest, a wine cooler. Okay, so this is the living and kitchen area. Master bedroom is over here. Different kind of wood. So you have that wood, this tile, and a smoother wood. A lot of natural light in here. And different angles. It's pretty builder grade um, shower and tub. Like you could put all three kids in that tub. It's so big. Masters, very spacious. Not sure what happened up there. Very big closet. Linen. Toilet area. It is a jetted tub. Have the pool right outside the window. It's actually pretty quiet. But you can see where your neighbors are. That mirror scared me earlier. <laughs> see, there's just some strange wear marks. I don't know what they had here. Like, I don't know. I don't know what they did. So on the other side of the downstairs are the two secondary bedrooms. See, everything just looks really worn. Like this. I don't know what they were doing. This is more of a laminate in here. This is not a wood floor. In. and a Jack and Jill but no tub in here just the shower another secondary different color Oh, that's big. Full, but big. And then up to the bonus room. So these stairs have got a little bit more of a pitch to them, even though there's not a landing. One big bonus area. That looks like a goat over there. 
It's a dog, but it looks like a goat. <laughs> So most of all of the living area is downstairs and there's a lot of it. So this might be hard for your girls to really be released outside unsupervised because you've got a deck, which is great for entertaining. And it is a big backyard, but they're going to have to go down there to really play. This is your septic. Lots of steps. For the sure-footed family. Let's see, your huskies would have fun with that. Those are the only neighbors that are kind of looking right over you. But I would worry about the rest of the stairs and the girls playing outside by themselves. quite the foundation here. <laughs> and the neighbor's dog. Okay, I will get this one to you. You let me know what you think.